Hey what's going on guys and in today's video we will be discussing on how I created this mask scene inside of, inside of Blender. We will be also discussing a few tips here and there so stick around till the end. First of all I added in a single, single cube that adjusted its dimension and, and extruded some faces till I get the basic shape for the walls. I continued uh, doing the same uh, uh, tactic which was to extrude and then uh, uh, I mean make the basic shape first. I then uh, moved on towards the little details towards the wall and uh, started making the basic shape out of the scene basically. After that I moved towards the entrance here there are the pillars and the door uh, things. Now uh, for, for the pillar I just added in a cube and then extruded its faces till I got a bit of a pillar shape. I duplicated it to, so that I could get uh, uh, and place uh, I placed more pillars on the other sides. I then added in a, another cube and then uh, and two two cubes. One you uh, use and then I used a boolean modifier to make the space for the uh, for the entrance, which looked pretty cool in my opinion, as you can see. Now I just fix the meshes a bit as they got a bit weird, but that's uh, all. After that I, I then used a boolean modifier again to make the windows on the top. When the, it was the same process as I made the entrance. I just used a boolean modifier as uh, usual. After that I used a, uh, a circle and then I started on making the bigger buildings. Uh, bigger buildings and the basic shape uh, for the uh, whole scene. I added in some more cubes and then adjusted its dimensions and modeled around the way, which uh, felt just right. Now when I had the basic shape for the whole scene, I then moved towards making a little details like uh, a little balcony or you could say balcony or some little extrusions on the faces. Uh, I could try to copy it as much as I could from my reference image on the top right. After that, uh, when I had the basic shape in my mind and in the blender software, I added in a plane for the ground. I uh, now I use the same tactic. I used uh, I made the basic shape first and then moved towards the uh, more advanced things. After that, I decided to make a straight light. I used it by make, adding in a curve and then it turned, converting into a mesh. Then I added in some balls and then added an emission shader to it. Now you may wonder how I scattered the light around. I just used a uh, volumetric shader for it. Now here's the final render and I hope you have enjoyed and liked this video. If you have then make sure to like and subscribe. See ya.